Oh, shoot. What y'all doing here in my bed with me? Uh, how y'all doing this lovely Sunday morning? <sighs> y'all early. Dang, y'all at least could have knocked. It is... It is 8.37, Sunday, August 12th. I got to work at my second job today at 1 o'clock. <sighs> That's what y'all get for being in my face. I got braids right now. Ooh, don't judge my edges. Judge yours, boo, because they've been a... It was a Sunday. Yeah, let me tell y'all, I had a whole breakdown after I broke my hair. I I quartered myself cut my hair, but once I cut off like my first ponytail, like I just broke down. I start crying and I cut the camera off. I started asking God, why you let me do this to myself? <laughs> I started looking in the mirror. I'm like, you stupid. Why would you do that? But, you know, I got a headache. I'm hungry. I need to figure out what I'm going to eat. Y'all, I've been thinking about doing a, a mukbang. Mukbang, mukbang. I don't know what it's called. I don't know how to say it. Mukbang, mukbang, mukang, like mukak bang. But I was thinking about doing one, doing a collab with someone, or I might just do it by myself. <laughs> I just gotta figure out what I want to talk about, or y'all can let me know what y'all want me to talk about. Actually, follow my social media down below. My Twitter is Terry Lachey underscore. My Snapchat Terry Lachey no underscore and my instagram is terry lachey underscore so you follow my social media don't forget to like comment and subscribe y'all we at 260 subscribers let's get to 300 y'all y'all that's a lot to me because i started with zero fan base and we up here at 260 and it's giving me it's giving me hope like it's giving me like it's letting me know that y'all you know y'all really do y'all really do fuck with your girl like excuse my language but you know, I cut sometimes. Shit. Get some lights. I need to get a ring light because the lighting in my apartment is sucks. This is natural sunlight that y'all seeing right now. I mean, below the... Yeah, I need to find the cheapest ring light, okay? Because I'm balling on the budget. Not even balling. I'm just on a budget. Gotta get that Vaseline for my face. I mean, for my lips. Because after I rush around too, they be dry. They be dry. But I'll be back when I get dressed. Gotta get the body off and get blessed. But I'm blessed with it on. So is you. Looking at your phone. Ooh. Y'all, I split my toe. Down the middle, honey. Y'all see that? Y'all, I split my toe, like, legit down the middle. Like, evenly, too. Like, I have no idea. I've never, I've never seen nothing like that. But, yeah. It's talking, no action, you just go CC coming I just keep elevating, no loss is just upgrading My lessons, make blessings, I turn Oh, I was talking about me moving to Charlotte next year That is my goal because I have been with, living in Winston-Salem um, For my whole entire life Like, I moved to Greensboro Like, when I was in college I stayed in Greensboro for like two years And then, when I was in college back in 2014 I graduated high school 2012, went to college 20. I don't know. I just start over, start fresh. Something new. Okay. Where was I at? Do y'all ever just sit in the car and just think about it? Like, it's hot in here. But I ain't, I'm not about to waste my gas. I don't put gas in the car for the week for me to get to and from work. Oh, hell no. I don't want no jalapeno chips. This morning, I thought they, I thought these was sour cream and onion. I guess this is uh, talk time with Terry. Have y'all ever been like, y'all ever been in love so bad, so much that you really just didn't see no wrong, you couldn't see no wrong. You get treated. I wouldn't say like you don't get treated. <laughs> you get you feel unappreciated. You feel unwanted. You feel just misunderstood. But you still wanted to. 
make it work. I hope y'all, I really can't even see. You still, but you, uh-uh, dragonfly. But you still wanted to make it work. But then, you know, at the time your eyes started opening, you start realizing shit. You start looking in the mirror like, I don't know who this nigga think he is, and I think he forgot who I am. Sometimes you got to do that because you lose yourself trying to love somebody who isn't really appreciative of who you really are. And, you know, you can't lose yourself because it's hard trying to get yourself back. Like, what more? Like, I don't know what else to give you. Like, hello, what the hell do you want me to give you? Do you want me to cut my damn heart out and give it to you? Like... You even gave all you got and it still ain't enough and it's just nothing, you know, so then you just got to do what you got to do. Change is so uncomfortable. Change is so scary, but it's good. Never get content, never get complacent. Don't get comfortable. It's always better. It's always more. Don't allow your past relationships to dictate your future ones because everybody is not the same. Like, and I know that we got trust issues. I know that we then heard, oh baby, I'm not gonna do this for you. I really care about you. I really love you. You mean the words to me, you so different. We all, we all done heard that before, but you know, some people out here in this world really do, really do mean it and really is genuine behind what they say. So, take time for yourself though. Like being by yourself, taking time to yourself, starting to learn yourself, you know get yourself back to who you were before it takes time and you know time heals everything love yourself like i'm still in the process of trying to uh, love every single flaw about myself because i got a lot but it's who i am it's who god made me and i have to embrace it i gotta you know you gotta flaunt it you know Fake it till you make it. Fake it till it's, fake it until you actually believe it. Like you got, you just gotta know it. It's always easier giving advice than taking advice, taking your own advice. Like I give some great advice to my friends. Sometimes I can't even apply it to myself. But I know the one thing: it's hot out here. I don't really know where I was going with this. I just felt like talking. I just felt like venting. I don't really vent to like people around me no more because i just feel like it doesn't even you know doesn't matter to them they, they could care less but you know i'm gonna start venting to y'all and i hope y'all vent, vent back you know you know give me some advice um let me know if you need some advice on something i can make a video on it um i can leave my email address down below so that you all can you know email me and i can start reading my responses on here oh that sounds like a great idea give y'all advice guys i can give you advice too because i i do put my i i didn't used to put myself in the other person's shoes but i had to learn that you know if i'm wanting someone to understand where i'm coming from and how i'm feeling about something then you also have to do the same thing you know listen more god gave us two ears and one mouth for a reason so listen more here i go going on another rant but don't try to make everybody else happy before you're happy yourself. You're gonna get you're gonna find yourself lost trying to please everybody, getting tugged and pulled and tugged and pulled in every which way direction. Like make sure you good first. And if and if people get upset with you because you can't do something for them or or with them or whatever the case may be, you know, start living for you and see how people react to you. You know, see how people see how, how they move. That'll tell you a lot about a person. That's it, y'all. Um, all my social media is going to be down below if you want to follow me. Um, I'm going to leave my email address down below, too, if anyone wants to vent about anything. Um, and the things you don't want me to answer, you just want me to reply back personally to you, then I can do that as well. I'm here for y'all. Y'all out here for me. We're here. Okay, T-Squad. I'm out now, y'all.